In Sevier County, an unusual vehicle was stolen from the parking lot of a Pigeon Forge hotel. It was a tow truck. Yeah. That is unusual. It was a red tow truck. The couple who owned it watched it disappear, but they couldn't catch the thieves before it was gone. WATE 6 on your side. Consumer reporter Don Dare talked with that couple, and they really need all the help they can get, Don. Well, they sure do, Lori. That's right. Pigeon Forge police tell us stealing this type of vehicle was brazen, especially in a well-lighted parking lot. Unfortunately, there's no video of the theft, but the couple watched the unidentified driver escape on a back road. Me and her dad totally went through the motor, all the hydraulics on it. For Jay and Janice Smith, their main means of income has been stolen. It's their newly refurbished tow truck, swiped from a parking lot. This is our money. It's the way we make our living. We want our truck back. The couple operates J&J Towing and Recovery in Sevier County. When their home's hot water heater broke on the night of January 13th, they checked into this hotel in Pigeon Forge. We took the truck with us. He had a tow the next morning, so it was easier just to go from there than to backtrack home. The couple had been in their room about two hours when Janet heard the distinctive sound of their truck's diesel engine. The truck had been locked. I'm sitting on the balcony. I hear the truck crank. I look up, the headlights are on. I'm like, oh my God, somebody's in our truck. So with that, I take off running down the steps, calling 911. You watched it being stolen? We did, off the fifth floor balcony. Uh, when, I, when she told me, I ran out, and I was like, oh my God, it's leaving, it's leaving. By the time I get to the parking lot, the truck is gone. Completely vanished, disappeared, no sign of it. Went Sugar Hollow Road, out of sight. We, we never seen it again. Uh, we called two minutes, 39 seconds. We had the city of Pigeon Forge there at the location. Uh, they responded very quickly. You don't hear very often of tow trucks being stolen. No, sir. No, this is very unusual. And that was the same thing the investigator had told us, that this was very unusual. I think he said the first he had ever worked of this type. Their candy apple red 1997 GMC diesel was a model that did not include an electronic ignition that year making it easy to hotwire. I don't understand how it just vanishes. Were there... Cameras on, everywhere. Cameras everywhere. This town has got them on every red light. It's got them on every building. We don't understand. In Pigeon Forge, motels line each side of the busy parkway. On average, highway records show 55,000 vehicles travel on this road daily. Over the last three years, local records show the number of stolen vehicles has gone down in the resort community from 66 stolen in 2018 to 41 in 2019, even lower in 2020 to 39 stolen vehicles. Jay and Janet are offering a reward for their truck's safe return. We've got a $4,000 cash reward on the truck. Not really that we can afford to put 4,000 out, but that 4,000 brings back our source of income. What we would like to do is get it back. We, we look to get it back. Well, Janice said the truck had been in her family for years, that her father and Jay had recently refurbished it inside and out. Again, the truck had been locked and apparently easy to hotwire since it didn't have that electronic ignition. The couple is hoping their reward will be an incentive to contact police if the tow truck is located. Well, that is something. Well, you hope that one of those cameras, like I said, with all those cameras around, you think something would turn up. All right, Don, thank you. Keep us posted if it does turn up. Uh, if you have a consumer question for Don, send him an email at ddarewat.com. You can also call a six on your side hotline number at 865-633-5974.